able to do anything. But apparently not. Alright, to the water element. The fifth one's near the left. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Good thinking. I like how I just have this trio. Like, can I just take this little gang of stars with me everywhere? Oh wait, let's go get B Mario. Or let's just swim. We could just swim probably. Well, yeah, I kind of do. It's because they assume, the the thing is they don't want you to be too fast because then they assume you're not working, you're not like spending enough time with each individual person. But as long as it averages out in the end, that's all it matters. What's up, Carabrace? The simple tip! No! I took the wrong path. Well, yeah, kind of. Well, the gist of it is, so, like, on an average phone call, you're supposed to spend between five and seven minutes, and then it's very good to be as close to five minutes as possible. 99% of people have trouble completing the job and, on average, being finishing at five minutes, but I've been finishing, like, everything I need to do within, like, three minutes. And they assume that you're under-servicing if you finish in three minutes on average. So that's the gist of it. So what that means is I've literally, like, someone pick up and I'm just like... Do whatever they want and offer, like... Or I put them on hold for no reason, or... I just be like, oh, do you want me to help you out with, like, all these million things that I have no business... Like, I, you could literally do it by yourself and I could just... Hang up right now and you can take care of it on our website, but I'll help you out because I literally have just time to spare. Oh, you want to check with your family? You want to check with 300 other people? Yeah, go for it. I'll, I'll wait while you do all these things because I have so much time on my hands. That's pretty glorious. The stars are best friends. Yes, what could be better than star friends? Well, sweet. We got another one. Well, if we came all the way here, let's talk to the old man. What do you've got to say? There's all kinds of hubbub in the seaside. What's going on? That's all you had to say? <laughs> really? Okay, whatever. Man. Oh my gosh, no! Are you kidding me? We lost it all. That was horrible. Oh well. I remember where they all were. I think. Yes, you are the best Athena! You are indeed! Because I don't know all these other Athenas anyway. Let's go. That was so bad. And that's happened to me so many times too. That is not a first even remotely. Yeah, I like the word hubbub. It's just like hobnob. Did you know hobnob is a synonym for hangout? Like, what a great word. There's so many good words in this world. There we go. And jump! Jump, 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 good friend. Okay. Jump here. Yes. And up we go. Yeah. Awesome. Yes! We are approaching speedrunning base, Athena Gamer. You are so right. Um, jump! So we're gonna get three in a second here. And I know where the other two- wait a minute, do I? Where are the other two? Oh my gosh, no! No way! I do not have too many recommended name games. You know what? Let's, um, come back here later. I've had enough of this star. I don't think there's any other one besides that one. I don't think there's any other. Oh wait, golden toy time. I know you guys like toy time, so we can go do toy time. That star is so punishing. Actually, it's not that bad. All right, so how do we do toy time, Galaxy? Yeah, that, we were off to a pretty bad start, but that's okay. It happened. Shouldn't we all- I think this quote is like so indicative of Marxism. Gravity sucks. Yeah, all oh, the gravity. Ruining our day! Why, gravity? Yeah, I'll hand you the controller. 
But you better wear the wrist strap because I'm sure as heck not. And that's how people break their TV. Jammas! What's up, Jammas? <laughs> you heard Toy Time, yes. Apparently, everyone's a fan of Toy Time. Toy Time is pretty glorious. I'm ready to play with some toys. Yes. The question is, what do we do, where do we go, and why do we need so many star bits? Like, star bits, I think they're literally here just to give, give you some reason to have motion controls for this game. Oh, please, please. Please have faith. I will get better! I will definitely- whoa. This is crazy! That did not seem safe at all, but it worked. We lived that time. Your shiny Charizard! Well, that's so awesome! I am so glad you got a shiny Charizard. What could be better than that? A shiny Lucario, that's what. And I like your shiny attitude about your shiny Charizard. So this is where the going gets not only tough, but insane! You can quote anything you want. If you know the syntax for it. I don't even know what it is. I think only Tommy knows how to add quotes. Starbits subtly backseat. Oh, you think so? Really? That's fascinating. Oh, come on! Jump! Yes. Yes! Sweetness. Lord. Okay, so this is... Oh, that's an arrow! I see, except the backseating that these star bits are giving us is more like I figure out where I'm supposed to go after I figure out that the star bits are backseating. So it's like they're giving vaguer hints, and the star bits are giving hints that are more cryptic than anything. Alright. You got a shoe pet. That's cool. I want a pet for out my shoe, a shoe pet. Star bits sometimes do. That's cool though. So if you're lost, you'll just be like, all right, Star bits, show me the way. Oh man, I almost walked out. That would have been bad. First edition Charizard, you do? That's crazy. I still have my Pokemon cards. I have a big binder full of them with my Mewtwo and everything. And that's pretty exciting. All right. All right, come on, Mario. Spring on over here. Sweet. So, this is like everyone's favorite. Is this a boss? Is it? The star bits are very trolling. Yeah. Well, it's like Portal. If you can see them, you can get them. So how are they? You mean their tips are trolling? Well, I don't consider them tips, really. I just consider them... Your pet is dust. You got shiny dust? Well, that's because a lot of things are crazy, Mitsuri. Do you realize how crazy this world is? Oh man, that, well, I mean, that is crazy that we have to go back down. Oh, well, this is easy to get back up. You too, yes, I do have a Mewtwo. I think everyone who went, went and saw the first movie got a Mewtwo card or something like that. I don't really remember. $2,000? Dude, you should totally sell it. I think my Mewtwo's worth like $8 or something. Maybe I should sell my old cards. Like, who buys them? I guess collectors. Why do people collect everything? Why do people pay $2,000 for a Pokemon card? I think it's indicative of people having too much money. You could say because people like the Pokemon card, like, a ton. I don't think that's the case. I think whether you are a collector or not, there's no way that you value it, that a normal human can value it at $200, $2,000, unless you have insane amounts of money. Rex. Sweet. Jump. Oh man, a big bat. This guy's going batty. Okay, sweet. Wait a minute, why can't I turn this screw? Oh, there we go. I think we were turning it the wrong way. Sometimes I forget this This game is Japanese and you have to turn screws the other way instead of the regular way. Charizard is OP as heck. HP and damage output? Nearly unmatched, really? In the card game? 
I never actually played the card game. I think I only played it once, but I collected all the cards. Did Kamek die? Oh, Kamek just poof. Chaos Gunfetti, yeah, that's a pretty awesome card. In Magic, it's a card where you literally, to use this card in Magic the Gathering, you have to rip it up and then throw it onto the playing thing. And then anything that it touches is removed from the game. So it's a card you get to use one time, exactly once. How do we get up here? If only I had somewhere to get higher. I feel like we can almost do that. If we do like, maybe a wall jump? Or if we do like a sideways jump? Oh man, we can almost get up there. There has to be a way. We can wall jump, but maybe if I could, what is the point of a camera, of camera controls, if you can't turn them in a difficult situation like this? Oh, finally, we got up. Awesome. Whoa. So that's mandatory to do? I feel like you have to be, like, tech skill filled to do that. So I don't know if this is... It revealed the star, but who knows how far away that is from... Oh, man! I thought I was going to have to... Wait a minute. Let's talk to these robots first. Good job. You did it! I guess I owe you a thanks. We saved their people? I thought we were done for. Well, I'm glad you're not. $27,000. That's crazy. Well, that's cool. That's not Kamek. It's a Magic Koopa. Oh, there's only one Kamek. Man, I didn't know you knew so much about Mario. DSJ. That's crazy, man. But you're right. It is. Okay. All right, star bit count increased. Oh, saving. Good, good, good. Great, great, great. Okay, and let's get back in there. Wait, more tour time galaxy. More time to play with the toys. Sweet. Yeah, the music is the best because it's a Koopa that knows magic. Aha! <laughs> That's very interesting. Oh, cool. Moobot's telling people how to add quotes. That's cool. You knew a lot of stuff over a broad range of topics. Yeah, it seems like you really do. You know something about everything. But others who look like you are not split. What does that even mean? I don't know, but that sounds super cool. There we go. Jump! Jump. Ooh, Mario or Mario? Both of them will win. Or neither. Luigi will win. Oh wait. Cool. This is a pretty neat galaxy. Jump! Yes! Yeah, sweet! Tropical Freeze. Seems probably less rage inducing than the regular... How in the heck do we get that high? Alright, let's use the logic we've learned from other levels. Use enemies to get extra high. Maybe we pick up one of these guys. Can we? Is there a way? Is there? You guys, did I tell you that I made my own burritos? I am so excited about that. I got like, I wanted them to taste exactly like fast food burritos. So I got Taco Bell brand hot sauce and everything. Even though it has hydrogenated corn, corn, coin, hydrogenated oils and high fructose corn syrup and whatever. Who cares? It tastes like fast food burritos, so that's delicious. You don't use the enemies. Well, what do you use then? Because that one's like way up there. Oh, that's how. That's cool, it solved itself. We're going to a Zelda concert, that's crazy cool. That is so neat, Athena Gamer. I want to go to a Zelda concert. Yeah. Jump. Run. 